Next in our countdown, we have Yu Yu Lam Lam, whose furry feeding experiment demonstrated to nearly a million of us that rabbits rule one small Japanese island. When I saw this video, I really wondered why the rabbits were coming up to the woman. Why were they chasing her? You know, are these ravenous, man-eating rabbits? And no, this isn't Rabbits Rising. It's Okunoshima, where it's always bunny rush hour. But how did they all get here? Uh, <clears throat> here. This is an island in Japan uh, to which five individual bunnies were introduced uh, back in the 60s. You would think that they would eventually run out of food um, to, to survive, but of course people go to the island and take food with them to feed the rabbits. So what is the biology behind the bunny bedlam? Rabbits have the potential to increase their population sizes very, very quickly. First of all, they reach sexual maturity at about four months old. A given rabbit could produce 40 baby rabbits in one year. So you can see that five rabbits breeding quickly um, will very quickly produce many more, and they will very quickly produce many more, and all of a sudden you've got hundreds and hundreds of them. But with a population founded by only five rabbits, isn't there a danger of inbreeding? Now, there's an interesting question here. Wouldn't there be a lack of genetic diversity having a population of rabbits that started from just five individuals? If these rabbits aren't very genetically diverse, they could all be susceptible to the same diseases. And so one disease could wipe out the whole population of the island. But in the case of rabbits, they have a very high genetic mutation rate. So the population is probably diversifying itself every time it has a new litter. And you can kind of see that when you look at the rabbits gathering around the girl on the street, that they're not identical rabbits. They're quite clearly different. And basically, the only thing that's going to limit their growth is going to be the amount of space on the island. There's nothing to make them go away. 